I would actually like to finish uh, playing Jeopardy with you. So I hope you remember we played it last week. And so let me just show you real quick the score. Okay, oh, sorry about that. So, okay, so our score from last week was, so let me see if I can get this bigger, Barry. So I put this, also a good repetition, in alphabetic order, okay? So that means every letter in the alphabet that comes, you know, first or second. So here the B comes first. So that is why Barry's name is first here in this list, okay? Because it's alphabetic. Okay, so Barry, last week you had 85 points. It's very good. Okay, Dylan, you joined a bit later together with Ryan and you have 40 points. So today you have to play really, really well and then maybe you can still win. Okay, Esther, you had 90 points. Very good. And Ryan, you too. And Stella, you also had 90 points. So it's very, very close. And now uh, we will see, okay? So we have, I think, uh, six more questions. So we will finish that now, okay? And then uh, after our game, maybe we have some time and we can start our new chapter. Okay, I will stop presenting here for a moment. Uh, so let me see, and then I will open our game here. Just a moment. It's okay, we can see this okay. All right. Okay, so I hope you can see uh, the board game here online, okay? All right, so we have, uh, let me see, one, two, three, four, five, six, and the final question. So seven questions left. Okay, so I'd say let's get started. And I would like to give Dylan the first try, okay? So Dylan can catch up, he can win more points. Okay, Dylan. Please uh, name your category and the points. Okay. Okay, 50 points for you, Dylan. The question, oh, sorry. So you can read the question and then you the can, answer. You can get this on your phone or in a battle, but what is correct? Don't worry about the timer. It doesn't matter. Okay. So what is the word we are looking for? Message. Yes, let's check. It's a message. Very good. Okay. That's 50 points for you. Okay, and this time I'm writing it down, okay? All right, very good. Then, uh, Stella, you go next. I can't see the oh. screen. Oh yeah, I'm sorry about that. Okay, there you go. <laughs> Can you see it now? No. Hmm. Okay, let me see. What I can do, I will stop sharing just real quick and then share again. Okay, can you see it now? No. Hmm. Can can the others yes. can the other students see? Okay. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, we we can see it. Yeah. Okay. Maybe Stella, can you try? Maybe uh, let me think. What can she do? Um, 
to see it again. I guess maybe if you just, if you leave, maybe, do you think that will work? If you leave our call real quick and come back, maybe that will help. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, in that time, uh, mm -hmm. let's give Ryan the next one and then Stella will get the next question. Okay, Ryan, please. Feelings. Okay, feelings 50. Okay, you can read the question first and then the answer. How did work feel in the location? Is can you say that again, please? How did work feel? In his interpretation. Mm -hmm. Bored. He was bored. Very good. Yes, he was extremely bored. Okay, very good. Thank you, Ryan. Then Stella. So now you're back. I hope you can see our uh, game. Yes. Great. Okay, then it's your turn now. Playing games. And other fun activities. Okay, 50 points. Poker is a very popular game. What kind of game it is? I think it is a card game. Okay, let's check. That is correct. Great. Thank you, Stella. Okay, 50 points for you too. Okay, then Barry, your turn. Mm, Harry Potter, 40. Okay, Harry Potter, 40 points. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. mm. uh, it's... Uh, and uh, it has, uh, it has three kinds of ball. Mm hmm Yes, very good. Uh, 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 is, is, one is red and you can, um, mm, throw it like mm -hmm. basketball. Mm hmm very and good. Two, second is black. He will fly and want to uh, fit you. Mm -hmm. And third is golden. Mm -hmm. Very if good. You uh, catch the ball, you win 150 points. Very good, yes. And can you tell us, Barry, do they run in the game or how do they play it? Uh, they fly. Very good, yes. Okay, so let's look at the answer. The name of the game in the English version is Quidditch. But you explained it perfectly, so that's 40 points. Very, very good, Barry. Okay, thank you. Okay, then let me see. It's Esther's turn. Uh, final question. Oh, um, that will be the last one. So you have to pick one of the Harry Potter questions. Okay. Um, Harry Potter 30. Okay. Which board then do Harry and his friend Ron like to play? Um, Can you say that again, please? 
Quidditch. Uh, Quidditch, yes, they like to play Quidditch, okay. And But that was uh, the game to fly, right? Do you remember they also like to play a board game? Uh, it is chess. Okay, let's check. Very good, yes. It's called Wizard's Chess because Harry and Ron are wizards. They can do magic, but yes, it's chess. So very good, 30 points, uh, sorry, Esther, 30 points for you. Okay, then we have, let's see, one last Harry Potter question and then the final question. So Dylan, it's your turn. And you get Harry Potter for 50 points because we have to finish this first. <laughs> Okay, Dylan. What is the name of the school Harry Potter goes to? Do you know the name of the school, the magical school? that Harry Potter goes to? I don't know English. Ah, okay, I see. That's okay. Um, do you, can you maybe describe the school a little bit? Is it very small? Is it big? Can you describe it? It's big. Mm -hmm. It's very big. And it is probably, is it very new? No. Oh. Ah, so it's very big and old, yes. It's a castle, right? Okay, that's okay. Uh, let's see. So I think you explained that very well. But maybe, let's see, does somebody else know the English name of the school? Let's see. Does anybody else know? Maybe? No? Let's see. Maybe a uh, Barry. Do you know the English name for the school? It's the Hog Hive. Mm -hmm. Let's look at it. It's Hogwarts. Okay? Hogwarts. Very good. So that's 50 points for Dylan, and I'd say another five for Barry. That's okay. <laughs> okay, and then we have our final question. So let's look at, at our last question. Oh, what is this? We want the final question. Okay, so let's see. Um, Ryan, could you please read this? When you send Tang a text message, what would you send him? Mm -hmm. Do you remember? Send him a message. Mm -hmm. Yes, she sent him a message. Very good. Okay, wait. I'll ask uh, the girls. Maybe they remember. Stella, do you remember what kind of message Maggie sent Tom? I only know she sent a picture to him. Mm hmm. Very good. Okay, let's see. Esther, do you remember what was on the picture? Mm. I don't know. You don't remember? Okay. Uh, let's see. Um, Dylan, do you remember? Do you remember no. 
No? Okay. Uh, let's see. Then, Barry, do you remember what was in the picture? I think it's a cute dog. Okay, yes. Let's look at the answer. It was a message. Very good. With a picture, also good, of her cute dog. Yay! Okay, perfect. I would say that gives all of you another extra points because it was teamwork. Okay, great. All right. Like I'd say another 20 points for all. Okay, and then actually we have a lot of winners now. So uh, let me stop sharing here for a moment. Okay, so our final score. Actually, we have three number ones now. <laughs> so Dylan, Ryan and Stella, you all three have now 160 points. Very, very good. And then next are Barry and Esther with 150 points. So you were all really, really good, okay? Okay, great. Thank you, that was fun. All right, so this was a nice game and I think it is also a nice way to start our new topic because now uh, we will um, start talking about playing cards, okay? So a game, playing cards is a game. And we will uh, read a new text about playing cards. Okay, so, but before we start this, uh, let me go back just real quick, because I would like to know if you actually play cards. So let me see if I can stop sharing here for a moment. Okay. All right, let's see. Ryan, do you play cards? Yes. Okay. What is the name of your favorite card game? I don't know. <laughs> Probably not in English, right? Can you say it in uh, Chinese? Do you know the name of your favorite card game? Can you repeat it, please? Is that right? That's not the name of the game. I have no idea. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Doesn't matter. Maybe the others know this game. I'd be curious if you do the others know his game. Let's see. Esther, do you know the game Ryan is talking about? Yes. Okay. That's good. And so the others too. Stella, do you know this game? No. Okay. Hmm. Interesting. Let's see. Barry, do you know this game? I don't heard it okay, before. You have it. Okay, hmm, interesting, but Esther knows it. And I guess, Dylan, you know it. You probably play together sometimes, right? Yes. Okay, let's see. So, Barry, what do you play cards? Do you like to play cards? Mm, yes. Okay, what is your favorite card game? Mm. I don't know the English name. Okay, what is the Chinese name? Uh, da lao e. Da lao e. Okay, yeah. do the others know that one? Stella, do you know that one? Yes. Okay. How about you, Esther? Do you also know that one? Yes. Oh, okay, I see. I think, Esther, you are a big card player because you already know two games. What is your favorite card game, Esther? 
I don't know how to say it. Okay. Can you say it in Chinese? Chou gui pai. Chou gui pai. Okay. Do the others know that one? Let's see. Stella, do you know that one? Yes. Okay. Very popular game, maybe. Dylan, do you know that one too? Yes. Okay, great. Let me see. Then I know now your favorite games. How, uh, how about you, Stella? What is your favorite game? Favorite card game? It's Da Lao E. Oh, I'm sorry. You already said Da Lao E. Okay, so then yes. who did I not ask? Dylan, I don't know if it's your favorite game too, what Ryan mentioned. What is your favorite game, Dylan? Mm, I don't know. The, the English name? Yes. Okay, what's the Chinese name? Xi mm, Jian Ban. Okay, Xi Jian Ban. Okay, I will have to learn some new names too. Okay, very good. So I see I have a lot of card players here. I'm happy about that. Um, so, because uh, our new topic will be playing cards. And so we will learn a couple of words. So you can explain your favorite card games with in English. Okay, so let's learn a couple of new words now. So do you, let's see if you already know this. Uh, so this here are, these are called diamonds, these cards. Okay, so you can repeat after me first. Diamonds. 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 Very good. These, uh, here. These are clubs. 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 Very good. Then hearts. Hearts. Very good. And spades. 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 Very good. Do you know um, what these cards are called? So with the A. Do you know what they are called? Let's see. Stella, do you know? I don't know. Okay, no worries. We will learn. <laughs> okay, let's see. So, first of all, diamonds, clubs, hearts, and spades are suits. Okay, so you can repeat after me. Diamonds, clubs, hearts, and spades are suits. Diamonds, diamonds, hearts, and spades are suits. Okay, very good. So this here is a suit, and this one is a different suit. This one is a different suit, and this one is a different suit. Okay. Now. What I wanted to ask here is what kind of card this is called, right? So it's a spade, but it is also the ace, okay? So the A, this card here is an ace, okay? So repeat after me, ace. 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 Very good. Usually, the ace in many card games is either the highest or the lowest card. Okay, it depends on the game. So we have four different aces in four different suits. Okay, so we have here the ace of diamonds the ace of clubs, the ace of hearts, and the ace of spades. Okay, so 
I would like you to repeat this part after me, okay? So we have one ace of spades. One ace, one ace of, of ace. spades. Mm -hmm. One ace of hearts. One, one ace, ace of hearts. Mm -hmm. One ace of clubs. And one ace of diamonds. And one ace of diamonds. Very good. Okay. So here I have found, let me see. Yeah, we still have a little bit of time. I have found this other game online. So we will we will play this here in a bit so the game is we will have three cards and then you will see they will be shuffled and then you have to pick one card to find the queen of hearts okay so i hope this will work out okay so let me just stop sharing and start sharing again Okay, so which cards can you see? Okay, let's start with Barry. What cards can you see? Mm -hmm. uh, mm. You can start Queen with just one card. Hearts. Very good, yes, the Queen of Hearts. Okay. Dylan, what other card can you see? So Barry mentioned the Queen of Hearts. What other cards are there? Eight. Could you repeat it again, please? Eight. Um. There is no ace here. Um, we have here different suits. And we have here the number. So what card is this? Maybe just the number. Two. Very good, yes. So this is a two. And now let's see, Esther. What kind of twos do we have? So which one is this? Which one is that? Um, clubs and speed. Mm -hmm. Very good. Yes, we have two of clubs and the two of spades. Very good, Esther. Okay, so now the game is really simple. All you have to do is watch the cards being shuffled and then pick the queen of hearts okay so we will try uh so i will start here okay so the cards were shuffled okay shuffled and now let's see ryan what do you think which one is the queen of hearts So it could be the left card, it could be the middle card, or the right card. What do you think? Legal. I'm sorry, I didn't I didn't hear that. Can you repeat it, please? Legal. The middle, okay. Ah, oh, sorry, no. She was here on the right side, Ryan. Okay, so we'll try again. So the cards were shuffled. Let's see. Um, uh, Stella, I'll let you try. I think it's the middle. Okay, the middle again. Let's see. <laughs> No, I'm sorry. She seems to like the right side. Okay, 
we'll try again. Okay, Dylan, what do you think? Where is the Queen of Hearts? Nick. Left? Yes. Okay. Ah, and now she was in the middle. Okay. Wow, she is hard to find. Okay. We're watching the cards being shuffled again. Okay, Barry, your turn. Uh, middle. The middle. Okay. And she's on the left now. Wow, she really is hard to find. Okay, one more try. Esther, what do you think? I think it's um, middle. In the middle. Okay. I'm sorry. <laughs> she was always somewhere else. So, but don't worry. If you want to, I will stop this. Okay. Um, let's go back here for a minute. If you want to, you can try again at home. Okay. So I put the link in the slide so you can try finding the Queen of Hearts at home too. Okay. So let's go back to the presentation. All right. So another word that we learned today is to shuffle. Okay. So I will, let me see. I can write that down here. To shuffle. But I will stop presenting here so I can see you better. Um, Let's see. Okay. I hope you can read this okay. To shuffle. Okay, so you can repeat after me. To shuffle. Shuffle. To shuffle. Okay, perfect. And we learned the four different suits in cards, okay? And then next week, we will try to read our new text and learn some new words, okay? So we can talk about it. And then after that, I would actually like for you to tell me about your favorite card game, okay? So we'll do that next week. And maybe then you can explain your card game to me, okay? So I can learn new games that way. Okay, so let me go back to the presentation just real quick again. Uh, there. Okay. So if you want to, you can play this game again at home. So, and then I put this here. It is not really homework. It is just if you want to, you can try to learn some English with Harry Potter. Okay, so I found this video online and you will see a little bit of the movie in English and then you will get to answer some questions. Okay, so if you want to, you can just learn a little bit of English uh, watching the video. Okay, but if you don't have the time, because I know you will be busy with your exams, that's okay. So don't worry about it. Okay, so it's just if you want to. Okay, great. And this is um, all that we needed to learn today. So I think really good job. Let me just stop sharing here. So I hoped uh, I hope you liked Jeopardy. Was that okay or was it too hard? Let's see, Ryan. Did you like Jeopardy? Was it a good game? Ryan, can you hear me? <laughs> yes. Okay. Did you like Jeopardy or was it nah? Okay. What do you think? 
喜欢喜欢那个猜谜游戏吗 ？Jeopardy。Yeah. It was okay. Okay. How about you, Stella? Did you like the Jeopardy game? Yes. Okay. So I will keep it in mind. How about you, Barry? I like it. Okay, great. And Esther, was it okay for you? Did you like Jeopardy? Yes. Okay. And Dylan? Yes. Okay, so I will keep it in mind.、Uh, so maybe then some other times we can also play it again if you say it's okay to play. All right, so I keep it in mind. All right, so I'm guessing now that you already have eaten dinner, and so I'm wondering what will you do now in your free time tonight when the class is over, Stella? What are your plans for tonight? Mm, I will study for、oh. the exam. Okay. Wow. Very good. Okay. So you working very hard. All the best with the exams. Okay, Ryan. What are your plans for tonight after class? I write my homework. Okay, homework. Okay, very good. Esther, what will you do now that the class is over? I will do my homework. Also, okay, Dylan. I correct my homework. Okay, you will also do your homework. Wow, Barry, what will you do after class?、Mm. Uh, do homework and maybe read a book. Oh, okay, and a book for fun or for school?、Um. Uh, for fun. Okay, that sounds good too. Yeah, get a little bit of rest. Okay, so you guys are so hardworking. Wow, that is really great. So I hope you will have a really good evening tonight, and that your studies will go well, and all the best for your exams next week. Good luck. And then I'll see you again next week. Okay. Have a good evening. <laughs> Bye. 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 <laughs>